Senator Limmer. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, members, we've, uh, we've certainly seen the opportunity, and we probably will see more opportunity today, to raise the tax on a higher income of people. Now, regardless of whether or not that's good policy or not, I do want to remind people that these people that have higher incomes, with higher incomes they have higher or they have more options at their disposal. They can easily move. They can easily change residence. There's plenty of states out there that don't even tax income in our country. And those states even have a warmer climate in the wintertime. So when we start considering perpetuating our increased taxes on the higher income class, which is not new. Everybody thinks it's new in today's uh, political discussions on the news of raising taxes. We'll solve all the problems by just raising taxes on more people that happen to make a little bit more than anyone else. Well, that's not new, and it's certainly not new in Minnesota. We've been doing that for 20, 30, 40 years. So I guess it's just more of the same old, same old approach to solving our financial difficulties. But nevertheless, 10.95 certainly puts us very high on the scale as far as income tax, uh, taxation, and at the same time we're taxing people that have options. And they're exercising their options already by simply moving out of the state. Now what happens in a few years when enough of those people do leave the state, we don't get their revenue stream, and then we have a huge negative, then who are you going to tax even higher then?